Morning, Jan. Uh, Eleven minutes late, defective axle at Wandsworth. Yes, take a letter with you, Joan, to the Walloo and Raspberry Commune, Bruges. Thank you for your letter of the 17th alt, uh, explaining the reason for the mushiness of your early raspberries. May I point out that this is the third time in the last three years, and I'll make that the fourth time, Joan. This is the fourth time in the last three years, and that this has occurred. And... <laughs> Late? She's never late. Can't be ill. Take a letter, Joan. Certainly, Mr. Phelan. <laughs> Ready when you are, Mr. Phelan. Uh, 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 come in. Uh, oh, Joan. Oh, uh, uh, come in and sit down. Uh, feeling a little chesty. We'll uh, <laughs> we'll soon have you examined. It isn't about me, Dr. Morrissey. Oh, pity. Oh, well, um, can I get you something to drink? Oh, thank you. Uh, would you like uh, cough mixture, cod liver oil, syrup of figs? <laughs> uh, I've, I've got quite a nice little mouthwash. Well, I don't think I will have a drink after all. Oh, yeah. It's mm. about Mr. Perrin, Doctor. Ah, oh, yes. Well, do you know what's wrong with him? Uh, yes, I do. Middle age, exhaustion, boredom, anxiety, self-disgust, misery, sense of inferiority, uh, dislike of industry, dislike of instant pudding, 25-year itch, fear, insecurity, frustration. What can we do about it? I haven't the faintest idea. <laughs> there must be something I can do. You could try being a little nicer to him, I suppose. That might help. I see. Are you sure you want a little chesty? No. Uh, well, uh, let me examine you anyway. Go on. Uh, uh, do a cart with your uncle. Go on. No. <laughs> June, don't worry about Reggie. He's brought things to a crisis. That's good. Is it? Oh, yes. If I know anything at all about medicine, it means he's over the worst. No, you really must go a little more slowly, Mr. Perrin. You really expect far too much of me. <laughs> oh, oh, you've noticed, yes. Well, I had it done specially for you. You like it? Good. No, I haven't got a boyfriend at the moment, Mr. Perrin. Well, I like you, of course I like you. You know very well I've, I've, I've always felt it. I've, I've always... Do you know, Jen, I've always felt very worried about you taking a dictation in this chair here. So, uh, I was just testing it while you were at the receiver's cup. Is it comfortable? Yes, it is yes, very good, comfortable. very good. Will you carry on taking dictation, Mr. Very good. CJ. Oh, uh, morning, CJ. I want to see you, Reggie. Yeah, certainly, CJ. Uh, straight away, it suits me best. Certainly, CJ. Seeing CJ straight away. Uh, oh. 